This is stock number 21T67. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Dodge and Dodge Durango headquarters. Today we are, I am excited to show you this brand new 2021 Dodge Durango in the all new reactor blue color for 2021. And this vehicle has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor. It's gonna get you 25 miles per gallon on the highway. 18 city for a combined total of 21. This one also has the premium one group and it has the black top package on it as well. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is the best way to check out the looks and styling and color of the vehicle before seeing it in person as well as the options on this particular vehicle. And if you'd like to check out all the photos on this Durango in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to our website. Click that and check us out there. This one comes with the 20 inch black noise painted alloy rims and those come with that black top package. That's how you get those rims. And it has Pirelli Scorpion Verde 26550 R20 tires. These are an all season tire on here. You do get that sport hood. That's a $1,495 option. Comes with the LED headlamps, LED running lights. This one has the technology group, which gives you the adaptive cruise control and lane departure. The black top package also gives you the black on the back of the uh, mirrors here. Enter and go system. We'll take a look at the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. I'm not going to go through everything, but just some of the main points on here. You can see it is a 2021 Durango GT blacktop all-wheel drive. It has the 3.6 liter 8-speed automatic transmission. And then your optional equipment is right there. You get the customer preferred package 2BE, which is $4,000. I'm guessing that's the GT package there. And everything there is standard, but since this one has some extra add-ons on it, uh, like the Technology Group, which is a $24.95 option, you get the Advanced Brake Assist, Rain Sensitive Wipers, Lane Departure, and Full Speed Collision Warning Plus, and Adaptive Cruise Control with stock. Black Top Package is $12.95. You get those rims and the badges and the exterior mirror backs. Premium One Group, $24.95 is this Power Sunroof, Navigation, Black Roof Rails, integrated crossbars on those roof rails, nine Alpine amplified speakers with subwoofer. Um, you get the Sirius Guardian, 4G LTE, and then this one comes with the all new Uconnect 5 10.1 inch screen on here. So that's pretty cool. We'll check that out in just a little bit. You also get the second row tumble chairs, which is 1195. Performance hood is 1495, and the all season tires are 395. Blind spot and cross path detection is $4.95. Your total MSRP is $53,925. It has a three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain. And if you'd like to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of your screen, is a link to our website to see all the rebates and incentives on this particular Durango. 25 highway, 18 city, 21 average. And then your crash test ratings, they only have side and rollover rated, which is side is five stars and three stars on the rollover. They redesigned the dash on these for 2021, and we'll get into that in just a little bit. We'll finish the outside walk around. Point out that it does have the four-wheel disc brakes. You get those backup parking sensors, the dual chrome-tipped exhaust. You get those blacked-out Durango logos and GT logo, the LED racetrack tail lamps there. Once we get it get all the lights on and get it running, we'll check all those out. Those third row seats do fold down and they go down pretty nice and flat. And when you put both sides down and that second row, you have a nice area to haul extra stuff and they go down really easy. And then to get them up, you just grab the strap and they come up really easy as well. Not much effort there. Storage in back here, that's your subwoofer right there. And then your jack tools are in there as well. To get this down, you press this button. It'll beep at you three times. And then it begins its descent. 
You do get LED license plate lights and a backup camera back here. This one has the capless fuel fill. Has the heated mirrors with the blind spot monitoring. You also get the directional signals on there. Inside the GT package gives you the black leather and suede interior. You get the titanium stitching on there as well. Factory floor mats, auto headlamps, tilt and telescopic steering wheel. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors. You get this kind of carbon fiber trim on the doors. It does have memory driver seat and then you have this black chrome trim throughout the interior here. Then we'll hop inside and take a look at the instrument cluster and radio. So you get the big seven inch uh, LCD display there. Got the digital speedometer, has the compass, you can put time, miles to empty, all that good stuff on there. Has the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls and adaptive cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. And then on the bottom, it's the flat steering wheel. You get the paddle shifters as well. And then this is the all new 10.1 touchscreen radio. You get kind of two screens here. It's set up very similar to the uh, 8.4, except, you know, it's of course wider. And I'm sure if you wanted to make this full screen, you can just by pressing that. This is also where your backup camera shows up. You can do your comfort here. If we turn the ignition on, everything becomes accessible. Notice you do get the dual climate controls right there. You can do your heated seats, heated steering wheel there. And then you can check out the backup camera at any time. And then you can fold those headrests down in back, which is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, you do get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on this vehicle. Down here, you get your dual climate controls, the more tactile controls if you don't like using the radio up there. And um, you also have more tactile heated seats and heated steering wheel controls. Your start-stop capabilities, sport mode, eco mode, stability control, obviously your hazards, lane departure warning, and your parking sensors, you can turn those off and on. You do get two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an AUX jack, eight-speed automatic mechanical shifter there, the keyless entry with the remote start, they didn't change that. But I really do like the dash on here. It's uh, nicely laid out, looks really good. Um, I like all the controls there. The space down here to put cell phones and stuff is really cool as well. And I think on the, you can get the option for a cell phone charger here as well too. Not on this particular one, but notice the black chrome around the radio and everything. But you also can do Android Auto and Apple CarPlay on this vehicle. You can add the devices and stuff like that. And I'd have to play around with the radio a little bit more to get it to show you everything on it. And we could probably do just a video on that radio. Anyways, you have the power sunroof up here. Your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems, map lights, and you do get SOS and assist buttons in that rear view mirror. We'll take a quick look at the back seats. They didn't do much for redesigning the back seats or anything. Still the standard Durango back here. You get the tumble seats, which I believe are $11.95 or right around there for getting the tumble captain's chairs back here. These seats do fold down like so and they fold up like that to get to that third row. And you get a third row two-seater back there as well. These back seats are heated and you do get a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in back here and two more USB jacks. You get that carbon fiber on the back door there as well and the child safety locks. And as promised, I'm going to do one more final walk around with all the lights on here. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you will have been able to tell just how good looking the new reactor blue color is. And check out all the options on this particular Durango GT all wheel drive with the black top package.
And I'd like to thank you again for checking out the video and to see more pictures of this Durango or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. It links more Dodge Durango videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom, link to this video on our website, or this vehicle on our website. Click those, check us out. And we're super excited to be offering the 2021 Dodge Durango GT all-wheel drive blacktop in reactor blue metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video.